Well, the Air National Guardsman accused of leaking top secret intelligence documents appeared in court this morning. He was officially charged and a federal judge ordered him held until a detention hearing next week. Rena Roy reports from Boston. Less than 24 hours after this dramatic arrest, 21 year old Jack Teixeira facing a federal judge charged with unauthorized retention and transmission of national defense information and willful retention of classified documents. Charges that collectively carry a maximum of 15 years in prison. An FBI SWAT team in full tactical gear swarming his Massachusetts home to share a seat on his deck as agents move in. The low-ranking enlisted airman and IT specialist for the intelligence wing of the Massachusetts Air National Guard with his hands above his head, then handcuffed, arrested in connection with the massive leak of classified Pentagon documents. The Justice Department arrested Jack Douglas Teixeira in connection with an investigation into alleged unauthorized removal, retention, and transmission of classified national defense information. Investigators searching to share us home into the night for evidence, working to determine what may have driven him to allegedly leak hundreds of highly classified documents, causing a global diplomatic fallout. The arrest comes after a teen whose identity was withheld, spoke with the Washington Post with permission from his mother, claiming to know the alleged leaker calling him by the nickname OG instead of identifying the leaker. He says they were part of an invite-only chat group on the social media platform Discord, where last fall OG began posting those documents to impress his friends. I would not call OG a whistleblower in the slightest. I don't think that there was a goal nor some sort of accomplishment that he was looking for in sharing these documents. We do have stringent guidelines in place for safeguarding classified and sensitive information. This was a deliberate criminal act, a violation of those guidelines. President Biden has been briefed on the arrest, arguing that while the leak was very concerning, the information was outdated. Rena Roy, ABC News, Boston.